Okay, this is a quick video tutorial on the takeoff from Gibraltar. Any monkeys up there? No, I can't see no. Gibraltar, takeoff from runway 29. Everything's ready to go. As you can see, we're just getting the pushback tug in. Uh, it's a nice day, not bad at all. Let's go back to the flight deck and we'll, and we'll sort of uh, departure out. So, as you can see, all the boxes ready, everything's done. Everything set up, flight plan, let's have a quick look. Let's move it out of the way for the time being. We're actually heading out to the beef but we'll not be flying the full flight. Just doing a departure. It's a very tight turn, after take off, obviously you've got the rock, so I've put an outer marker. About five mile I think it is, if I'm not mistaken. And I'll head the wards out. Just to go up, I've got to put the radial on and I do declare, sorry. Five mile radial, and then um, that's a departure. And then after that, we'll turn left and head back out towards the, the Mediterranean, and I'll show you on the chart what's happening. Okay, we'll, we'll come up to Gibraltar, zoom in a bit, we'll be flying out here, coming around. Hopefully, we'll have enough room to get past the rock for the, the flight plan we've got. And we'll head out to Pimis, which is our first navigation mark. And then it's up past Malaga, which is there. Cross over the mountains and down into Ibiza. So let's get started. Let's jump in the back end of the deck. Let's have a look. Okay, so we've requested our departure. That's what about the flick of the screen there. Da -da -da -da. Continue pushback. And that's us. We'll be going nose right, tail left. Locking gear. So let's get the beacon on. Got the APU running. We need the fuel pumps on. Not using any checklists today again. Just quick tutorial. You don't really need them. Ground controls on. Seatbelt signs on, on. And have a look at the two. And that's our old set, the overhead. Put that back on the arc. And that's us going. Release parking brakes. Set the timer. Release the parking brakes. Commencing push. All engines are clear. Start at will. Okay, so we shall set the ignition to start. And we shall start engine number one. Engine number one starting up. And two's rising nice. There we go, and one's coming up. Let's have an external view. Dee -dee -dee -dee. Good. Everything's going as it should. Okie doke. Get back on the flight deck. There's engine one spooling up nicely. That's coming on nice. Okay, that's engine one stabilized. Please set parking brake. Set parking brake. Sort engine two. Your confirmation for a good engine we'll give a confirmation because it will say, be sitting waiting for ages. You know when we've got engine two started. Start. Engine one's available. Unlocking the nose gear. Hey, let's have a look at our taxi. Very simple. So we shall be taxiing along Bravo on the Echo. And then turn on the runway, we'll get my strobes on, and we'll turn back on the first runway 27. And that's our taxi, very easy. Just see any weather around the area for A little bit of rain, but that's below us. Make a little bit turbulent, hopefully. Okay. 
Lovely. Left is clear. So engine two stabilized. Ignition are normal. Let's go ahead and turn the APU off. APU bleed off. Monster switch off. Let's do a flight controls check. Available here. Get the old big old feet on the pedals. Full right. Full left. Full up. Send that. Full down. Send that. Full left rudder. Send that. Full right rudder. Send that. Let's have a look at what our configuration is. Down 0 0.1. There we go. That's that set. And we need to go into the wheels now. Okay, so let's get set up. We'll go with flaps one, ground spoilers to auto, auto brake max. Looking good. Let's turn predictive wind on. Let's go ahead and there we go. That's us ready for taxi. So, as I say, we're going to head down, go over here, not there to go, turn on the runway. And then we'll take it from there. Okay, so let's get nose wheel lights the taxi. Do, 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 everything's good, 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 good. So that's us ready to taxi. We've got flaps one. Okay, let's release the power brake. These bloody pedals. Okay, let's give a little bit of power, get we moving. I don't think we'll need much, we're not very heavy bit here. Already on the spoilers, I don't know why that keeps coming back up. Let's ding the cabin. Put them in the seat. Need to adjust the sensitivity on the steering. It's really excessive. That's for the later date. Need a bit more power there. Once we get a good climb rate, I shall be putting the autopilot on so I can get a few views around the, the rock. Sip of the old coffee there. Slow down a bit. Have a turn. Okay. Let's get my strobe lights on. No ATC today, just a little tutorial for you for takeoff. It can be a little bit awkward this airport. A lot of awkward winds around it. So stop there, check left. We've got live traffic on FSLT if I'm not mistaken, how do we see it? Really good. Okay, let's get moving, too much power. And for some reason she doesn't want to move. Come on. Why isn't this moving? Getting a lot of power to get it going. Not very really heavy. Nice shift sail, would it say? That's a brilliant add on.
Okay, we have to do our takeoff configuration. Come on, get round. It's going to stop there a little bit more power. Hopefully, they've stopped the traffic crossing the, the runway. Notorious for its runway, the Gibraltar. Okay, that's just practically lined up. Let's stop there. Okay, take off config. Flat Mac 2 disagree. Let's have a look. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Performance. Oh, it's a flap two takeoff. Oops. Good job of check that. Take off configuration. Right, let's clear ourselves for takeoff. So we're gonna go with landing lights on, nose wheel lights to take off. Everything's looking good. Turn that brightness down a bit. On the PFD and that's us ready to go. It's a toga takeoff, so I'll shut my mouth and let these hear the engines. One last thing, T gas on. That's where checklist coming on here. Okay, let's go 50%. Release brakes, toga, Montoga, SRS, there's Monastia, there's Rotate coming up, Rotate. Shaggy, positive rate, that's the wind's blown, gear up, let's just get this climb up, get it up out of the way, so we can get past the rock, alright we'll click over the pilot now, so we can get some views, we should be far enough room from it, let's go and leave our climb, Let's first claim, claim, nav. Beautiful views. Very good. All the ships, amazing. Let's have a look out to the window, see what we've got. So we'll go. Uh, and flaps too, nice shadows and look at that. <laughs> Cruise liners at the rock. Oh, we're well above the height of a rock now. The reflections are beautiful. Very nice. So we'll go with flaps one. Two is looking out the windows. This one ground spoilers. All the brakes off. Keep the seatbelt signs on for now. Yeah, that's well out of the way. We're well above it. Got it on the terrain on the first officers. ND. That's really good. So let's go flaps up. Okay, we're climbing up for our cruise altitude, which is 340. Very colourful, lad. And there's Gibraltar Rock. Yeah, we're past that nicely. I'm well above it. Right, let's go over standard. And we should be starting to turn pretty soon towards Malaga. Heading towards Pimos first with our first navigation mark. Let's have another look. Scenery, is it? That's just a normal uh, a sober scenery, it's nothing added on. 
off in the ship somewhat are you in traffic so we've got two easy jets there still in Gibraltar nothing coming in yeah plenty of ships Whoop. okay I suppose we're claiming out let's start tidying up a bit we can release the cabin and also release the seat belts. Didn't put the nose wheel to take off. Once again, checklist. I'm going to start using them all the time now. And I do believe that's Mobile out there on the left. I've got Malaga over here somewhere. And I've got the dreaded white dot back. Let us know in the comments if you guys are getting them because it's an absolute nightmare. Didn't start a chrono. Thousand six hundred. We could turn the land lights off. I did put the nose wheel lights on. I've just turned them off. Okay, and that is departure from Gibraltar, Lima, Extra Gold Bravo. And as I say, we're heading over towards Pinnis. We're passing nine thousand seven hundred feet. All the lights are off. Everything's good. We're going to start accelerating up. There we go to our cruise altitude and speed with three hundred seven knots. At flight level three four zero. Uh, we're just about to make the turn from Pinnis. I'm not far off it. Um, Pinnis, we've got 10.6 mile. As you can see, yeah. Yep. Yeah. So we've got our speed brake sign back. All the little things add up. Yeah, we're accelerating up at 350 knots ground speed. Tear us along. We'll wait till we turn, then we'll call it a day. Tom Molinas and Ben Medina around there. Um, that's where we're heading, just over here. So we've still got first claim, claim in nav, all blue. Climbing nicely, 2,600 feet a minute. Could pull the speed back and make our claim faster, but it's doing pretty well. Less than 60 mile to the top of the claim anyway, so. I don't think I've noticed that before, that's the time. Got your distance there to your next waypoint. And I've never noticed the time there before. Maybe it's just me, I don't know. Anyway, that's the departure out of Gibraltar. I hope you've enjoyed. Just a quick tutorial for you, and I shall catch you soon. Thank you very much. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Any comments are grateful. Thank you.